life of a YouTube blogger. Five foot tripod, backpack with camera gear, and I'm heading out to record a video. Hello, my name is Big O. I'm a YouTube blogger. That's what I do. I blog on YouTube with my Hero 8 Black. When you got a Hero 8 Black, who needs a Hero 9 Black? Not me. I'm a YouTube vlogger. I just gotta go vlog, people. Got my camera gear on my, in my backpack. I'm a YouTube vlogger. That's what I am, a YouTube vlogger. See ya. Where am I at? Guess what, people? I'm using my GoPro Hero 8 Black camera. I'm a YouTube blogger. I'm a YouTube blogger, that's what I do. I'm a YouTube blogger, and I'm so cool. Oh yeah, I'm so cool. I'm right here at the Meadowview Conference Center, right here in lovely Kingsport, Tennessee. One and a half miles from my home. I'm at the Meadowview Resort and Conference Center. And I park my car right here. You feel me? Everything's beautiful and green. Here comes golf cart. It's security. Easy go. I used to work at the golf. <clears throat> when I lived in Georgia, I worked at the golf course, the Noonan Country Club. I worked at the pro shop, the golf shop. I was over to the driving range. I helped in golf tournaments. But you didn't know that about the big O. Oh yeah, I know how to tee it up on the green. I know how to tee it up on the green. Let me get my Titleist or my Callaway, my Foot Joy, or my my Foot Joy or my Titleist shoes. I prefer, I prefer Foot Joy golf shoes. Let's go tee it up on the green someday, but not tonight. It's about 7:26 p.m. right now, and you can see this is a beautiful place. Everything's lovely and green. Here's the main entrance. One of the main buildings right here where you check in at the hotel. Just, man, look how green the grass is. Everything's manicured, beautiful, like me, like the boy, the big O. I walk away. They must have had some kind of golf tournament today. If you recall last week when I was here doing a video, it was about two weeks ago. I say a week and a half ago. I was parked over here, same area, but I was parked at one parking space on the other side of the bushes. And uh, there wasn't no cars here, but obviously today they had a golf tournament or something. There's a bunch of cars, and I seen it says valet parking over here. I, I seen a bunch of golf carts. I don't know. Unless, must have some. Could be having some kind of special event right here. <sighs> you want me to do, walk all the way around to the front? Reserve parking for handicapped people. I'm handy, I'm mainly handicapped. Does that count? Maximum penalty. Beautiful. Would you say? Van accessible, reserved parking. Man, this grass is so beautiful. Look at this. This is pretty too, isn't it? Oh yeah. Look at this. What does this say? Can mask are required? I'm not going inside anyway. It says convention center. I'm impressed. Are you impressed? Hanging out with your boy, the big O. It says September 11, 2002. September 11, 2002. This tree was dedicated in memory of those who lost their lives and to honor all affected by the tragic events of September 11, 2001. So exactly a year after September 11, 2001, exactly one year later, they planted this tree in memory of all those who died 
from the September 11th, 2001 huh? terrorist attacks. That's nice. See the black right here? All right, now we know. It's birdie. Do you agree? All right, I'm missing. I don't know. We must have something big going on here tonight. Probably rich people. I'm probably not included. They're probably saying, what's that dude doing with the camera? Well, I, I'm press. I'm press. I'm the big old press. That's right. I'm the big old press. They must get you got that car. It's got a paper tag on it. I'm doing press. I'm the press. I work for the big old YouTube channel. If they ask me, what are you doing? I'm doing journalism. I'm a journalist. I'm a press. I'm press. Big old channel on YouTube. How do you like it? Just a big old show. No parking. I can take a ride on his golf cart. And this is where you come in, check in, in the hotel. There's a front entrance. Welcome. This is Registration Convention Center. Sit up here on top. Masks are required. So now we know. Welcome. Registration left. Convention Center to the right. You can sit up here over the doors. People don't like it because I don't got my camera out. Oh well, and ain't do about it. It's the big old show. People in that car kept staring at me. I point the camera at them. Guess what? They get on. Nobody stops me. Meadowview Marriott. See, that's the Marriott. The hotel here is the Marriott Conference Resort and Convention Center. Now you know. It. It's probably more dependable. And a lot of bands, a lot of people drive the Chrysler's nowadays. And the Chrysler's the transmission's bad about going out in them. They keep this place up pretty good, would you agree? People's coming, so I'm gonna turn the camera around on me. They might not want to be filmed on the big old show. I know everybody likes looking at my pretty face. How y'all doing? Good, how are you? Y'all golf today? Uh, maybe next uh, later in the week. I should have brought my gloves, but I didn't. I'm going to finish. I, I, I try not to film everybody because you know a lot of people don't like to be on camera, so that's why I turned the camera around on my face, my pretty face. I know y'all like looking at my pretty face anyway, you know? It is what it is, right? I like this place. Hotel. Nice, ain't it? Do you agree? It's not too expensive. Because me and when my son came up last time, little O from Atlanta, which he's bigger than I am, my son, we were going to rent a room here and it wasn't too bad. So now y'all know what it looks like, the entrance. Like I said. And the golf, there's a big golf course over here on this side. And also, you have the cattails. Uh, we can play golf over here, cattails, golf shop, whatever. And on the back side over here, when where my vehicle was parked, if you go all the way around, like here's the hotel, the front entrance. If you go all the way around here and, and bear back to your left, there's a golf course, uh, a pro shop in the back back there. If not mistaken, that one might be private. The, the golf course in the back and the cattails, which is over here, is the one open to the public. Come until I walk over there and show y'all. But 
I don't have GoPros don't do that good in low light footage and it gets dark pretty soon so I don't have a lot of time to film really because all GoPro cameras when it gets close to dark the digital the electronic stabilization gets crappy beautiful tree right here Here's around here. This is the cattails. It says the cattails at Metaview. So now you know. Here we are at the cattails. Got plenty, plenty of seating back here. See the tables? This is the back. This is the front entrance. Cattails at Metaview. See the golf ball right here? That's the front entrance. Looks like a golf shop to me. A pro shop. Brings back memories when I worked at the Indian Country Club at the pro shop. Little town uh, 22 miles southwest of Atlanta on I-85. You can see golf shirts in there and everything. Oh yeah. Socks, golf shoes, whatever. Please leave the flag stick in the cup. <clears throat> so this is cattails. <clears throat> Y'all get a pretty good idea what it looks like. If you look over here, see, see this is the golf course over here. See how green it is? All the golf uh, carts we used at the Nina Country Club was Yamaha. Green, the green Yamaha golf carts. And right there in Nina, Georgia, there was a big Yamaha plant that manufactured the golf carts. Right up the street from where I worked at the pro shop at the Nina Country Club. It's a bunch of golf carts. I want to get in one of them just ride around. They probably wouldn't say nothing. What do you think? Get off that golf cart. beautiful would you say this is the back side of made it, uh, the cattails see right here it's pretty would you agree nice and green and clean just the way I like it welcome to cattails at Matterview. Beautiful sky. Alright here now in back of the cattails the golf shop. And this is what it looks like out back. Got tables. If you want to sit out here and eat, drink your coke or whatever or beer or whatever they have in there. I've actually never been inside the shop. I like it. I'm impressed with this place. It's nice. I'm just gonna head to the house. And here's, the, of course, the hotels right here beside the cattails, the Marriott. I guess the whole building's the Marriott the hotel. They keep everything neat, neat and the manicures. I really like this. I'm trying to go slow when I'm moving my camera around because the GoPros don't perform at getting low light. It's nice. So here.
Yeah, they have beer in there because I see signs that says Michelo Ultra, Land Shark, whatever you want. Big O quit drinking two months ago, so. It's what the back part of it looks like. You got grills back here. Look here. Looks like a smoker right there. Uh, that ain't no smoker. I think that's just a grill. Propane grill. It's beautiful back here. It's almost completely dark, so I don't know how this little clip will work out. There's a bridge you can walk across. It's a cart path, I guess. Back there. Yep. This is what it looks like. Here's inside. Check there, big low butcher, land chart, tables. I'm gonna close out. Thanks for watching. I heard the Meadowview Resort and Conference Center. It's almost dark right here, so I doubt this footage is looking any good. I'm going to walk through this little walk path, leaving the Meadowview Resort and Conference Center. You'll probably see what I'm talking about today on one of my videos when they, they the day they come out with the GoPro Hero 9. I said in low light conditions, none of the GoPros work good in low light. And really, right now, be honest with you, it's not that dark. But here's the deal use a one hour before dark, I will not use a GoPro camera. I don't care if it's a GoPro 1, a 2, a 5, a 6, a 7, 8, or 9. GoPros did not perform good in low light conditions. So I don't understand why people's always walk around at night with a GoPro or a DJI Osmos. Because none of these cameras with small sensors like the GoPros or the DJI uh, Action or perform good in low light. None of them do. I've had the DJI uh, Osmos Action. Same thing. It did not perform that great in low light. How does it look here? The thing about it is, the main thing is the stabilization falls apart. Because this electronic stabilization in good lighting conditions is super smooth, like using the gimbal in the daytime. <clears throat> but at night, like I said, it's like using the gimbal in the daytime. But at night, the electronic stabilization falls apart and it starts getting shaky most of the time. This is how it looks up here at dark. It'll be dark in another 20 minutes probably. I'm best to go to McDonald's and do a review. Somebody's wanting me to do a review on the uh somebody's wanting me to do a review on the new McDonald's uh spicy nuggets. Ch spicy chicken nuggets. So I'm going to go there and do a review on the McDonald's spicy chicken nuggets. So this is your boy the big O. I'm going to leave the Metaview uh, Resort and Conference Center right here off Metaview Parkway. One and a half miles from my house, right here in Kingsport, Tennessee. Come by here and see them at the Mediview Resort and Com Resort and Conference Center. Stop at the Marriott, get your room. Tell them your boy the Big O sent you. Big O's going to check out. Thanks for watching. It's peaceful.